Hello everyone, welcome back to Unbroken Pockets. This is Daphne, and if you are new here, welcome. First and foremost, I wanna give a huge shout out to all my new subscribers for rocking with your girl. I wanna tell you that I really appreciate it. So let's give it up for them, please. Thank you. I really appreciate the love. And to those of you who are new, Welcome here, we are on a debt-free financial freedom journey. And here I do cash stuffings, I do savings challenges, sinking funds, and finance education, budget check-ins, you name it, everything personal finance. So if this is something that you're interested in, please, hit that like button. It's a free way to help me out, rock with me, comment, subscribe, all of the things. So let's get into today's video. We are doing our first budget check-in for February. And I have my planner here where we're going to log my transactions, categorize them, and just keep track of how I'm doing with my budget. So far, we are going to go ahead and double check how we're doing with our daily cash. And yeah, so this is just to make sure nothing gets out of hand. I'm going to be doing budget check-ins weekly. My cash stuffings are every other week. So that will be for next week. So let's get right into it. Okay. So I have my planner here. Let's go to our transactions log. So I've already, as you can see, I've already um, logged all of my transactions in my account from the 31st to the 4th, which is today. And I'm going to go ahead and color code my transactions, make sure we are on track for our envelope so i have my digital envelopes here so these are my starting balances that i put into my wallet here so let me put this over here and okay so these are the digital representation of what I put into my daily cash envelope. So we are just going to go through and actually let me, so what I'm gonna do, I'm going to um, make sure I color code these, okay? And then I'm going to put, I'm gonna update what we spent here and the ending balance. And then the ending balance should be what I have in my envelopes. So I'm trying to get this tracking thing down. So, all right, so let's go ahead and get started. So first thing I did when I got paid was I had to put some cash, some cash, some gas in my car. So, um, so on my transactions log, I have the date of the transactions, the account. If it is my checking account, I put checking. If it's cash coming out of here, I put cash. Description, I put what it is. And then the category is what category over here it is coming out of and then the amount. So for gas, gas is yellow. So let's go ahead and grab yellow here and actually let me just i'm making it complicated so yellow and we're going to mark that so i spent 55 dollars in gas that is my only gas line so we are going to so i spent 55 And I have, or I should have, five 
left. So, and my highlighter went away. So let's do that again. Okay. And so then I tracked all my bills that I have coming out on the first. I have most of my bills come out on the first. So let's grab red because bills is red down here. So let me grab red and actually I think I can because in my elements and I don't know if you guys know good notes or not, but there's an elements here where frequently used things you can save it in elements so um so you don't have to be going back and forth and i think that's what i'm gonna do here because i don't want it i don't want to be taking up all this time highlighting but i'll highlight what isn't caught so I'm gonna highlight all my bills. So I have, so I had to get my driver's license. I already ordered that, my car registration. And the thing is, I didn't even account for those, but I normally have a buffer in my checking account. So I don't even have to worry about whether I have enough to cover um but i do need to include my buffer in my budget i typically just keep it in my account but i do want to start listing it when i do do my paycheck budget um and then another thing i totally forgot when i was setting up my um my envelope subscriptions so i'm seeing these subscriptions come out and i'm like i don't even have a place to put these so, and, and normally the subscriptions, they just eat up my buffer. So I really want to be more intentional about tracking those. So I'm gonna need to um, make a category for subscriptions. For now, how I have it, I just have it down here as its own little account um, because it needs to be accounted for. So, but it did come out of my checking account. So then, okay, so that's all of the bills so far. So let's calculate that. So we have 17, 40, 80, 70, 70, 51, 80, 118, 77, 26, 25, 89. That's actually 89. 99 so let me update that okay and we'll mark that back okay 89.99 and then of course 71.37 equals Twenty-seven ninety-seven at thirty-eight. So I'll write that over here. Twenty-seven ninety-seven thirty-eight so far, and I still got a little bit to come out. But that is all. I have at least this in my checking account for for my bills. Okay, so. Next, we're going to do eating out is right here. I actually did really good on eating out. I'm so proud of myself. I was souped because I just, uh, the convenience of ordering out is just ridiculous. And I just take it to a whole nother level or had been. And I did such a good job. Um with that and i think we only have two yeah we went to raising canes and then we went to starbucks today after we went grocery shopping so that i am so so seventeen eighty three. so we are under budget for eating out and that is just so i'm so proud of myself 
I've been cooking, I've been meal planning to make sure I minimize our expenses and I am prepared so I'm not just like, okay, let me just go on DoorDash. So, okay, so we have eating out covered and did I put the balance? Okay, so the balance should be, I didn't do the balance for my bills either, huh? Twenty nine ninety three. So we should have 10.07 left and eating out. And for bills, 38.37. And like I said, this might actually go over because I didn't account for my, um, I didn't account for my driver's license. I didn't account for my car registration. So that was like a hundred and what was that? Um, yeah, that was like $160 or so. So, um, three, eight, three, seven. Okay. Mine is two, seven, nine, seven, three, eight. That's 10, 40. 56 okay I still have um, I still have my phone bill my utilities and my insurance to come out of that okay so we updated those balances okay next is my daughter she did a little spending herself um, so and that was at Walgreens. And you know, it's just so funny. Sometimes kids, they just like to spend just to be spending. But this is um, typically her allowance and chore money. So I normally let her do as she pleases. Um, okay, so she should have 22.60 left. And see, look, my tab is about to die. 17.40 is what she spent. Okay, next is mine. I am blue. Okay, so I got a couple here. Some snacks from Speedway. I did get something on Amazon. Only $8.14, but Amazon owed me some money and um, it was in credit. So I needed to get an Amazon branded item in order to take advantage of that credit. So I did a little shopping, I guess. Um, this Apple charge here, I'm going, I'm actually putting that in my personal um i i actually purchased um affinity designer i really love that program um and so that was 19.99 so i bought that for myself and that is it so 21.55 plus 814 plus 1505 five and that totals 44 where am I at 44 74 okay and that leaves me with 15 26 okay so then entertainment, we have one entertainment item. And that is here, Walgreens. We had got some games and stuff. Um, so that was 32.09. And we started with 40. 3209. That leaves us with seven dollars and ninety-one cents. And and we are under and everything. Like I am so pumped right now. Okay, so next is miscellaneous. I think we have one miscellaneous item. I um what color is is that 
orange type color. Um, I cash at the relative, and that really should be like a giving category, but it's all good. And I want to change this color. It needs to be a little darker. Do I have images on? Okay. All right, so we spent five out of miscellaneous. That leaves us with 15. What am I doing? Okay, we spent five. We should have 15. Okay, and then I'm missing something. Oh, groceries. Groceries is purple. And, ooh, we were so good on groceries. Groceries budget was $150. We spent $143.20. And I actually thought it was going to come out more than that. But we did good on groceries. And we should, that should hold us for a minute and it did include some household items um and so as i see our spending itemized six dollars and eighty cents left our spending itemized a little bit more than in my um in my housing envelope i really don't even think i need to use my household envelope but um it would be good to just see what the difference is but because this wasn't all groceries i mean maybe for uh, with the exception of one or two items but we killed it six dollars eighty cents remaining and and i might and i didn't even get my diet coke actually i could use that to get my diet coke so groceries is done and like i said look four subscriptions i got here that i wasn't even paying attention you know apple just be going in and doing stuff um and i and i really do want to what color my color is i'm gonna do i'm gonna do like that blue right there so i'm gonna color these subscriptions and i really do need to write my subscriptions down so i may have to make a little spreadsheet for that because it's so automatic and because I keep a buffer in my account anyway, it's kind of like, it just eats up my buffer and I really don't even notice, but I need to start noticing. Um, I need to see if I need to be doing some canceling, if there's anything that I'm not using. But for the most part, I know I am using this stuff. $37.50, it adds up. So I'm gonna put that right here. I made a little section right here for that. 37. 50. Okay, so let's check our envelopes. I think I got everything. Yes. So let's check our envelopes. Make sure my balances are correct. All right. So, and then I'm, I think I'm going to empty out these coins too. Okay. Let me make sure you guys can see. All right. For groceries, we should have six dollars and eighty cents and we have six dollars uh i'm not about to count that change but it's 80. i'm actually not even gonna count any of this change we gonna count the dollars make sure we good okay so groceries is good um gas i spent 55 in gas okay i should have five dollars here it is we got $5 remaining. So I'll probably, um, cause I work from home. So I really, my tank be full for all month. Like I don't really be, my tank be full all month. So I really won't need to use this $5 probably for the rest of February. So like I said in my last video, I think what I'm gonna do with any remaining balances, we're gonna put those in challenges. So this might be put in challenges next week. So that one's good. So then we have eaten out. Eaten out should have ten dollars and seven cents. Let's see. We got ten dollars. Yeah, we right on the money. I 
I did so good this week. I'm so proud of myself, tracking everything, even because normally I don't even be tracking the cash, but I do need to track the cash because I just want to make sure I am being more involved in my budget. I need to see where all my coins are going. Jaden should have 2260. She has 21. Yeah, she got 22. It's in these quarters down here. Okay, so her envelope is good. And then mine, I should have 1526. And I got 1526. Okay. I am so pumped. I did so good this week. Okay, entertainment, we should have $7.91. We got seven. That was like 91 down there. All my coins, I got this little jar here. I got this from, um, where did I get this? Walgreens. Okay, that's going to be my little coin jar. Because I really don't like to be walking around with coins. Um, okay, so then miscellaneous. Miscellaneous should have. Okay, and you know what? Because miscellaneous, I counted, uh, what was miscellaneous for cash app? You know, I can't cash no cash app. So, so that $5 got to go in my account. Because miscellaneous still got that 20 in here. So, we are, look, look, we are on our way. We are on our way. I am so excited. So, let me put these balances over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just copy, um, what I spent and put them down here just to have an overview because I need that in order to kind of when I do my budget check-in for the end of the month to see if look, all of this coming along with it um oh my god hold on so and let me take out text boxes I just want to copy that. Okay. I'm trying to like, I should have made sure my stuff was charged up. I'm tripping. All right. Groceries, we spent $143.20. Gas, we spent $55, which is a blessing. Gas was a blessing because uh, a couple of months ago, that was more like $75. I was like, no, y'all, because I got to buy premium. I was like, yeah, this is not the move. I'm just glad I I work from home, so I don't really have to worry about what those gas prices were looking like, but it does look like it's starting to creep back up, so we're gonna see about that. Um, you guys, I'm so sorry, my camera died, so let's go ahead and finish this up. So I was, copying the rest of these so I have my daughter's spending we'll paste that here and my spending and then in the comment section you guys let me know how do you guys do this week have you been tracking your budget do you track and log your expenses. If you don't, I highly suggest it. In the last video I did, um, I was talking about Dave Ramsey and he is a big advocate for tracking your expenses. Just so you really know exactly where all of your money is going. So let me know how you guys did this week. And so next week, so I don't, I mean, I don't think I have many more expenses to do um, as far as my cash envelopes. We're good on groceries. My, ga my gas tank is filled up. Eating out, we only have $10 left, but we've been doing good with this envelope uh my envelope i have 15 dollars left there's really nothing else i anticipate i'm going to be spending my money on 
until the 10th so i get paid again on the 10th so um this is my budget check-in it was very successful okay we got our transactions logged and so for the next week i will be tracking whatever else is going to be coming out during that time but as far as bills um nothing else should be coming on my checking account because my bills so far are good to go until the 12th the 12th is when my phone will come out and so i'm not expecting any more checking account activity unless of course some other subscriptions roll through but what i'm gonna do i'm gonna need to get a spreadsheet together so i can um go ahead and figure out how i'm gonna be tracking these subscriptions because i don't have them in my budget so um i need to change that because i do need to track that and as i was tracking these expenses i was like you know what i need a subscription category and i need to make sure i'm budgeting for it because it's just been eating into my buffer which is another thing that i want to include into my um breakdown of my uh, paychecks so you guys will see those changes next week i will be more prepared for those so moving forward we don't have any hiccups so this week was very successful yes yes especially with the eating out i am so look at this when i tell you guys i'm talking about hundreds of dollars eating out is what i was doing in 2022 it did it don't make no sense so we are we're on our way so i am so happy today was a successful week i think um changes that need to be made are the ones i mentioned um as far as tracking my subscriptions and uh, making sure i have a category for that otherwise everything went as it should we're under budget on everything which i'll ch i need to change all of these to green these remake um, ending balances to green just so we know we have the green light we are good to go so again i want to thank all of my new subscribers thank you so much for rocking with your girl i really appreciate it to those of you who are new please consider like commenting and subscribing to my channel we're gonna get much more of these budget check-ins next week will be my cash stuffing we're gonna do uh, my daily cash we're going to do my savings challenges and i may begin incorporating my sinking funds i'm not sure if i'm going to do that yet uh, because i am trying to focus on getting this debt paid off so um, go ahead, let me know in the comment section what your guys' week looked like, how you guys did with your budget, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you. Bye.